Hey guys, hope you're well and welcome to this commission showcase. Have a real treat for you today. We've got some more Children of the Neverborn Chaos Marines for the guys over at SM Battle Reports. Now, if you're new to Siege Studios YouTube channel, then firstly, welcome here at Siege Studios. We're a UK based premium commission miniature painting service with 32 painters who all paint from our bronze premium gaming level all the way up to platinum, which is our competition entry quality. If you are interested in a quote with us here at Siege, then very simply, all you need to do is head to the description of this video where it says get a quote. Click on that link. It takes you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form. Once you're there, very simply select the drop down options from those that are available for your project and requirements. And in the message section, include a list of models in our model list format. Fire that off to us to hear back from us with a quote and get the process started. We're back in a second to have a look at these awesome chaos possessed and also uh, Doom Prince in more detail. See you guys back in a sec. So let's jump in, have a look at these awesome possessed models and the Demon Prince for this additional Children of Neverborn Chaos Force uh, for the guys over at SM Battle Reports. If you're unfamiliar with SM, they are the hosts of the No Retreat tournament and also do some awesome battle reports uh, that you should check out as well. Um, so let's dive in, have a look. This whole project has been painted by Nick, one of the artists here at Siege. Had a great time working on this phase and also the original army that we completed for the guys at SN. Um, again, the kit has is the Forge World Galvorbeck uh, models. Uh, that have had a bit of converting with extra weapons and bits and bobs to really make try and make as many of them as unique as possible. Uh, obviously, when you're using the same host kit, um, you know you, you can obviously have a few sculpts that are the same. So it's, it's we've changed weapons and bits and bobs to really make as many unique as possible. So I digress. Let's have a look at some of them. Uh, this chap here is just bounding forward, as you'll see. Uh, obviously, he's got loads of mutations all over him. Uh, main colorway, obviously black, red, copper, and then obviously we've got the pallid flesh kind of color. Uh, but then you've got this green complementary color to the red as well, and sort of a lot of the accent details uh, pus uh, dri dripping from like wounds and things or glow effects on sort of areas as well as you'll see there like for example on the sh on the knee uh, sections you've got those bits really really cool pose here he's just bounding forward about to swipe someone with this kind of like claw his power fist has kind of exploded there as you'll see uh, as this mutated hand has come out of it uh, obviously there's a more and teeth and things in this claw as well which is quite scary but <laughs> so that's just the first of the possessed uh, and we'll pull forward a few more so you can see as well um this guy's really really cool do you like his kind of like half kind of bionic half sort of mutated head as well which is quite cool uh but you can see chain swords and things have been put on some of them some of them got power weapons some of them have got uh, other weapons as well just to really sort of break up the the monotony of using the same model over and over but again you can see lovely super clean finish on all of these and obviously these are resin models as well just so you guys know um again you see all the script and everything done all the books and all the parchments uh, all done in blood as well as per the guys that request the sn uh, i've got this really cool chap here with like this green etheric fire billowing out of his shoulder pad there as well as you can see some of that in the kneecap as well which is quite cool so that's just uh, another one of these awesome possessed double chainsaw there you don't want to mess with him uh i've got another guy here that i really really like he's got a power sword uh, and i do like the fact he's got sort of like a half mutated half normal helmet as well which is quite funny um huge claw on him as you'll see there and again the power weapon all done there as well really really super clean painting lots of different stages of highlighting throughout on all the armor the reds the flesh work and also on the sort of different areas of copper as well which is really really cool so that's just him uh and let's pull forward a few more so you can have a look at them again another chap here again use the marine uh, helmet on him uh, just to distinguish him a little bit different from the other ones as well as you'll see again got a chain sword uh, but all the areas of detail fully painted and highlighted to a really really super clean lovely finish uh, again another exploding power fist there with the uh, mutated hand coming out of it which is really cool uh, and then we'll pull forward one more just to have a look who should we look at let's have a look at this chap here with the double claws um, again really cool head there on him just very different as well uh, again tried to make them as we said as unique as possible for the guys at SN so they do get a bit of variation between all of these models uh, but obviously um, it is the same kit used multiple times uh, again really really cool he's just like bounding forward or charging forward there as well as, as you can see stride in quite you know swung with a claw or something but really really cool so that's him and then we'll move on to the model which i'm sure a lot of you guys already know which is obviously the demon prince uh demon prince to, to obviously lead another portion of the force let's just get this to focus uh nick's done a really lovely job just uh, picking out every little bit of highlighting done across all the skin the armor uh, and uh, the horn works and bits and bobs like that uh, but as you'll see same sort of pallid uh pallid flesh kind of color with those green accents on different areas of the armor and all the bits of detail on him so 
like for example on the legs uh, and all around the uh, the back as well you see all the bits and bobs on the legs and the shoulders all that green hue and highlighting sort of, sort of kind of etheric glow which is quite cool um, and obviously he's got these green glowing eyes as well which is really really in keeping with the uh, with the rest of the force uh, and you can see the wings all the sinew and everything all painted on the wings to a really really clean fashion as well which is really really cool uh, so that's just the demon prince character to lead this uh, additional phase i do hope you like it we're back in a second to find out a bit more about taking out commissions with us here at siege and also you can have another look at these guys again see you guys back in a second So thanks for checking the video out guys, really appreciate it ever so much. I do hope that you've liked these additional Children of the Neverborn Chaos Possessed and also Demon Prince uh, that Nick had a great time working on for the guys at SM Battle Reports. If you are interested in the commission with us here at Siege and all you need to do very simply is head to the description of this video where it says get a quote. Click on that link, it takes you directly to the Siege website and our contact form and once you're there, select the drop down options from those that are available for your requirements and also what you want to choose. And in the message section, include a list of models in our model list format. Once that's completed, fire that off to us to get the process started and hear back from us with a quote. Uh, if you can do us a huge favour while you're here on YouTube, give us a subscribe. If you do hit that bell icon, you will be notified when new videos and content do go up on the channel. And also in the description of the video, you can find all the links to our other social media, so Instagram, Twitter, and also Facebook. If you can give us a like and follow respectively on all of those, you can keep up to date with everything that we get up to here at Siege. Thank you so much for watching the video. I will see you very soon on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.